very often the Almighty God compares the heart and the soul of the human being with nature, with land. The Bible often talks about the mountains and the valleys and the hills. And it not only talks about the external, but it talks about the internal. The soul of man has mountain tops, has valleys, has deep canyons through which the water flows. It's an environment in itself. And when the Holy Spirit of Jesus Christ comes into the heart and the soul of a human being, he enlightens and exposes and brings light through every dark corner of the human being. This is why when people accept him, they become radiant. They are full of light. But also, this is why why people reject him, because they don't want their dark corners, their dark deeds, their dark thoughts to be exposed to the light. So, a lot of people prefer to cover themselves up rather than open up and become naked and just empty, naked before the living God. Now, there's if you're looking for healing, if you're looking for mental healing, for emotional healing, if you're struggling with anything on the part of your soul, mind, will, emotions, as a child of God, as a disciple and a follower of Jesus Christ, you do not have to go outside to look for solutions. Because the Lord himself is your healer. In the book of Isaiah, for example, it says that, Now therefore, behold, now the Lord himself bring upon them the waters of the river of life. And that river shall pass and shall overflow and shall go over and shall reach even unto the neck and the stretching out of his wings shall feel the breath of thy land. So, when the Holy Spirit is allowed, is invited and allowed to overflow you, your soul, from the innermost being, that's when healing begins to happen. He will take you on a journey to set you free and to heal you. It says that I will satisfy you with water from the rock. So Jesus Christ is the rock. It's if he is enthroned truly on the seat of your heart, if he reigns in your heart, he will satisfy you with water from the rock. So his Holy Spirit will overflow out, will pour out from the rock throughout the mountains, the hills, the valleys, the crevices, every corner of your soul. And he will heal you throughout the land, throughout the soul. That water, that living water will cleanse you. Also, it says that God, God himself, God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit, they are the fountain of living water. And when the Almighty God is the King on the throne of your heart, the Bible says that from under His throne flows the water of the river of life. And that river of life is for cleansing. That river of life is for the healing, is for setting people free. So, in this video, I would like to pray and ask you, Holy Spirit, I open my heart fully to you. I open my soul, every crevice, every hill, every mountaintop in my innermost being. I ask you, Holy Spirit, in the name of Jesus Christ, to overflow me from under the, under the throne of God, from the rock. Fill my soul, satisfy my soul, heal my soul. In Jesus' name, God bless you.